ready for the women's NCAA Final Four in Cleveland has really been a labor of love for those who have worked years to bring it here. And now it's almost time. News 5 anchor Rob Powers joins us now. He was at this morning's tip off event. Rob. Well, Damon, organizers say the goal is to outpace and outdo last year's Final Four. That will be a tough task with the eyes of the basketball world on Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse the first week of April. Are we ready for this? Very ready. And I think that makes us feel great. We're inside of six weeks and things feel very buttoned up. A discussion this morning at the arena tipped off the whole thing. The national semifinals April 5th, title game April 7th. It is the mega premier elite women's sporting event in the world. Do you really believe that? I do. This is a homecoming for Lynn who grew up in North Royalton. Her father a commercial roofer. Lynn's in charge. The VP of women's basketball for the NCAA. Here there's still this like very deep sense of pride coming from this community and to have and to hear stories that my dad helped do the roof on the terminal tower yeah. or on some of the big buildings downtown. It's something I say with a lot of pride because that is hard work. And if that wasn't enough, ESPN will broadcast the semifinals. The championship will air here on News 5. The women's college game has never been bigger. The storylines could be huge by the time the spotlight is on Cleveland. Carolyn Peck. Are y'all ready? Another native Clevelander is on the broadcast team. This February now going into March, everybody better Tune in because anything can happen. To go for it all. A strong sport with big storylines, good players, teams, and fan bases. That's all organizers can ask for. Over $22 million will pour into the local economy. Economic impact is really measured by outside spending in the community that otherwise wouldn't have been here. So because that event has grown, this event has grown so much, we think once we get the study back, it'll be well north of that number. The goal when the champions crowned for fans to say this was the best Final Four ever. It's a big job with three big games to get it done. Can't wait for this thing to start, Katie. Oh, us too. I love those storylines you brought us from behind the scenes too. Good stuff. Yep.